we're promoting here some new part of our Zenturix um, solution range. The first one is a solution called stream to go It's an entire OTT platform over the top. It enables you to take live TV or live video signals, push them through our signal to provide streaming to uh, multiple screens from smartphone, tablets, PCs, and to smart TVs. We also record uh, the streams at the same time to provide a catch-up TV service. The main market is for, for media owners and broadcasters who want to add, uh, reach the new audience. Today we've got this uh, shift of viewing. People want to uh, view content both on the TV as a live broadcast or a pre-recorded uh, broadcast, but also on their tablets. So here we have the uh, iPad running with our HTML5 interface. We have all our different channels. So we have here like ProSieben, and here we're watching a live stream. We can bring that in so the users can view the stream. We can go back and rewind. So like a pause like TV, we can go back and view the stream before. We can switch channels very easily. If you want to go back and watch different days, we can then select from the day profile here. We can go back, say, to September the 9th at midday and look at the recorded program uh, for cable line. So here we have a uh, metadata that which shows us the EPG available, so the program guide. So if you want to watch a particular program, say you want to watch Navy CIS. We also have the ability to do what we call a storyboard. So we can look at thumbnails. And it will show a simple thumbnail of programs that have been broadcast earlier in the day. So we can go back through and say we want to look at this particular program here, we click the thumbnail, and then we start watching the program from that point onwards. So this is called stream to go So the other technology we're showing here is our, our audience ratings and analytics. So audience ratings and analytics is very important for broadcasters and media owners to ensure that they know um, how many viewers have been watching a particular program and more importantly, how their competitive offerings are working. So for example, in Germany, you have a commercial station like ProSieben and uh, national stations like RTL, they're competing for the same audience. And those two organizations would like to see how they're doing against each other. Now we can take the TV analytics information from people like GFK and Nelson, map that back into our database of the, of the recorded programs. We can even take in what we call the OTT platform, so where they deliver to uh, delivery networks like Akamai, Level 3, we can bring that information back into our system and provide analytics for linear platforms as well as OTT platforms. So here, we're looking at the channels. We've got some channels selected here. We've got Sat1, ProSieben, Kybelane, Sis, and we, we see them in different colors. So red for ProSieben, here we can see the viewers. So here we can see the, the, the viewers we're doing. We can take a range, and we can see how many users, the average. Yeah, we can look at the market share. We can even compare that, uh, bring in the EPG. So we can see what programs were being broadcast at the time and where people were switching. So on this layout, we're showing the audience flow. And what we can see here are people moving from ProSieben to turning the TV off or going to the internet. In this case, we've seen people coming from the internet coming to watch ProSieben. So here it's very important, as the, the programs are being broadcast, audiences are moving between channels and we can see that happening through the analytics. Now, all of this happens post-event because obviously it's, it's happened the day before or days before. So we can go back through many, many days and find uh, the information that we want to show. So here we can look over a longer period of time and we can see the channel patterns throughout the day. So here in the morning, you can see the viewers are turning from going from sleeping, they're waking up in the morning, going through the breakfast, and you can see the peaks and troughs. So people are going off to work, now they're coming back in from lunchtime, now we've got the evening, the peak time, people watching way into the evening. So you can see all these figures. We can have demographic breakdown as, here as well, so you can look at the age ranges, we can look at the, the type, uh, male or female or ch children. So, but you can look across the entire demographics of your audience.